bear with any interference that there might be for just a moment. Um, because apparently one explanation just isn't enough. So, I recorded this twice, because I didn't like the first run, but then I also didn't like the second run, commentary-wise. So now what you're getting is going to be some kind of weird conglomerate of the two. It's like a weird meshing of both. Um, it's going to be like really weird. So it's going to be jumping between both files and it's kind of messy and screwed up and all that. So I thought I should tell you so that you at least knew like what the fuck's going on because it's going to be jumping back and forth and it's going to be weird. There you go. Enjoy! At least it's done. Hello and welcome back toward the Human Tank's Altar. Full disclosure, I already recorded the final episode, well, of the first pad. There might be more, I haven't checked yet. Um, I didn't like it very much. Like the, it was just all pretty bleh. So we're gonna do it over. Um, I lost a few fights as well. They were pretty cool actually, I would like to show those. I'll probably attack them all at the very end, like, a little bit edited. Because, uh, the first defeat was pretty great. It was just me making a mildly, <laughs> a mildly risky maneuver and failing at it. And the other one was down to the wire, which was pretty great. Because man, you gotta go down to the wire, right? Okay. Okay. Why is everything so freaking expensive? Makes no sense, the prices in this game. How am I supposed to keep up with the enemy? They're running, like, way faster than I am. Where is the stupid assault tank? Found it. Okay, hopefully that's Tsubasa and not Kodama, but we'll find out in a bit. Alright. 100,000. Hmm. Yeah, no. Even if I want it, that's too big of a waste of money. I'm way behind already, as is, on everything. I guess we have to bust out these, uh, this, yeah, because we need it. I'm gonna have to run free battles at this rate, this game's being a dick. It's like just ramping up the difficulty too fast, too quick. I'm gonna do that before moving on, because otherwise I'd have to do it later. I don't want to do it later, because I originally did it, I think I originally did it um, either at the end or after we started using Ellie, one of the two. It was tranquil, mysterious, and dreamlike. Not a single murmur, not even the wind's whisper could be heard by the lake's side. Snow smothered all sound. Alter knew well the harshness of a mountain encased in snow, but even so, she remained warm. The echoes of footsteps were consumed by the snow in this perpetually silent world. I almost biffed that so much. Each and every step was shunned of noise. A small human tank laid bare in the desolate snowfield. It was a graveyard for human tanks, blanketed by snow and barren of sound. Branches never rustled, as if frozen in time. Snow extinguished all trace of existence, as if nothing was ever there. Alter is very caring. I'm sure she'll end up trying to protect me. I'll be borrowing your helmet. Goodbye. As if nothing was ever there. Ellie just jacks someone else's helmet, their prized possession, and then wanders away. That's Ellie for you. Final episode, Unwavering Instinct. Alter, wake up! Too sleepy. Come on, get your act together! Morning, Megaman. Good morning. Okay, good night. Good night. <laughs> Wait, no, don't go back to sleep! What do you want? I'm sleepy! How can you be so relaxed? Our next battle is about to begin. Good morning, Lieutenant! Why can't you be more like Ruru? You're full of spirit, Ruru. 
<laughs> yes, I am. Woohoo! Give me some spirit energy. Hey! <laughs> How much did you sleep? I didn't sleep. Yay! Natural high. So you want me to be more like that, Mega Man? Please don't. Where's breakfast? You can have the leftover rice balls from yesterday. Ellie didn't eat her midnight snack. I told her I made them, but I guess she didn't want any. Guess that's just Ellie for you. Hey, Ellie, are you up yet? You're not Ellie. Carrara, you should... should Carrara, should you be up and walking around? I'm fine, is what I'd like to say. Carrara, you mustn't get up yet. Don't be so fussy, Mega Man. I'm already an adult. <laughs> Shut up, Carrara. I don't think that's the issue here. Are you still tired? Maybe. How reliable! Was your head injured too? How rude! I'm perfectly sane. Maybe you should go back to sleep. That human tank left early this morning. What? Are you talking about Ellie? That's why I was against it. This is a line that will come up later. It doesn't make any sense unless you've already played the f***ing game. <laughs> I can't return to the front lines, so I'm leaving the rest in your hands, Alter. This bruise on my re on my leg, it's, it's really serious. I'm never going to be able to walk again, other than the time that I walked to this room. I really hope it's just a bruise. What? Leaving what? The Kingdom of Japan. What? You have full command of the army now, so make good use of it. It's your only choice. Does this mean... You can't be serious! Butchering words every step of the way. All forces charge. The Imperial Army is here! Distance 50, within firing range. L7, begin reloading and prepare to fire. Unit number one, reloading complete. Unit number two, reloading complete. Unit number three, ready to fire. They're not getting close to the capital. Stop them here at Shibuya at all cost using our lousy tier three tanks, right? And L7's like the third one you can get. Look, I'm just saying, our army is packing the highest of quality tanks. Uh, they're not. Recon complete. Firing! Incoming long-range focused fire. All units engage. Roger, and I'm actually useful this time because those are missiles. I can engage them! Shoot down all the missiles! February 28th, the final day of February, because this is not a leap year according to this game. Also, that typo was funny, but we're not going to make any more we're back in time references apparently because I forgot to do that, and then I referenced it, so that just ruined everything. Following their defeat at Yokohama, the Royal Army was pushed back into Kingdom territory. They prepared to engage the approaching Imperial Army at Shibuya, just before the Kingdom capital. After setting up the defensive line, they awaited the rush of the oncoming giant army. Royal Guard Division, what are our current tank numbers? 2nd Platoon has 30, and 5th Platoon has 24. That's all? That's more tanks than, than our corpse has ever fielded, but that's a very small number nonetheless, because reasons. <laughs> so even the knights under Karara's command couldn't withstand it. Alter, awaiting orders. Charge through the center, fall back immediately after eliminating their frontline tanks. Break open a path with the remaining elite survivors. As you command. Assault tanks support fire. Don't let them onto you. Continue firing. Charge! So many voices all at once. All night tanks, charge! Stop them at all costs. New type tanks sighted ahead. 43 spotted. What a huge force! Third shock squad, forward. Roger. Obstruct their attack. Self-destruct. Take this!
the Imperial Army is still advancing. Block off Route E with a Mammoth class tank. Artillery squad, focus fire once more. Firing! I'm not artillery! Yes, we stopped them. Realigning scope, distance 50, within firing range. Fire again! L7, begin reloading and prepare to fire. Reloading missiles. It's like we've already been here once before! I am also here! Again! Unit 3, ready to fire! <laughs> Wait, you guys didn't read your lines right! <laughs> Scout tank. Reconnaissance is complete. Fire! Launching! Main force, advance! We're going to lose. Watch it, other soldiers are going to hear you. Where did that huge army come from? The Imperial Army was likely preparing this long ahead of time. You know, like what you would do in a war. <laughs> they were clearly at a disadvantage. Hongu had secretly gathered a huge force of human tanks to the base from all over Kingdom territory. But she's Imperial... Whatever, you know what, I'm never gonna try. As commander of the Imperial Army, she built up her forces within the center of Fuji's forests. It took half a year to build up an army without, some, without attracting the attention of the Royal Army. The Royal Army had carried out a similar plan, but their forces were completely wiped out by Albatross. The few remaining tanks that were gathered to defend the capital did not stand a chance. Alter, we need Ellie to make more reinforcements. With Ellie's manufacturing speed, we should be able to at least... I have no other choice. What? Carrara knew that Ellie was missing, so she told me that my only choice was to make use of the army. Wait, but... I have no other choice! Alter. Ruru, are Dihone's tanks... tanks? Still in action. Do you mean Mio? She's struggling against the enemy's shock troops on the left wing. Damn it. Send scout tanks to the left wing. Roger, because that's going to be really efficient. You know, that'll help. Alter. What now, Mega Man? I'm getting really tired of your crap. Why are you so angry? I'm not angry! That's how an angry person would reply. Shh. <gasps> Shut up, Mega Man. You haven't done anything right this entire game. Get out. I'm not angry. See? Alter, you know why Ellie left, don't you? No, I don't. Alter, please, tell me. Forces stationed at the rear of Route 3. Have the assault tanks fall back until missiles have been fully reloaded. Fall back! Fall back! I didn't make it! Alter! Megaman. It's your fault, Megaman. You told Ellie what happened ten years ago. What? You told Ellie about my past. Ellie is probably bothered by the tank I was hiding from my parents. The Imperial tank I looked after when I was small. I don't know anything about that. What? What are you even talking about? What happened ten years ago? This is the first time I've heard anything about that. You didn't tell Ellie about it? Like I said, I have no idea what you're talking about. I can't talk about what I don't know. Unless this is the internet, then <laughs> everything's fair game. Yes, so you should know, Alter. I'm not the same Ellie as the one you knew. Where did you hear about that? Megaman? She said that a long time ago you lost an Imperial tank. That mix-up Megaman. Always ratting us out. Alter? That unbelievable liar! Alter, where are you going? I've decided. This time, I'm going to protect her. Alter? Megaman, take care of the rest. What? There's no other choice. I can't. Then start being able to. What does that even mean? It means stop sucking. Do your job. You haven't done anything right this entire game. Do something right this time. A white world unfolded. She liked snow. 
Was it because the character for Snow was in her superior's name? That was not all. Snow is white, and it piles up. And as it piles up, it covers everything up. Found it, just as expected. Oh no! The game of hide and seek! We've been playing it for so long! Fuck! I was stunned and so I thought I was so well hidden in my snow fort! A lake without a name. Scrap tanks, byproducts of research and development, are all discarded here. All tanks without a use are gathered here. Human tanks that do not resemble humans, or human tanks that resemble humans too closely, all such tanks end up here. The graveyard of human tanks. Snow covers up the fact that these tanks, cast away by humans, ever existed. Does that tank taste good? Why yes, yes it does, thank you for asking. You were altered from Gecko. Like it, you need to recharge as well. I knew you would come here. <laughs> it was starving. It was finally able to move, but it needed energy to sustain its giant body. It sniffed out meals in the form of human tanks, and devoured battery tanks. Despite the fact that we were previously told that it devoured any kind of tank, now it's only battery tanks. It's a brand new diet. Jenny Craig would be proud. It's gonna lose some weight for us. But it still wasn't enough. That's what happens when you go lean. It still wasn't enough. I think I clicked something too fast. Wait, but there's this new thing! But it still wasn't enough. It was okay, well fine. Never mind. I won't let you reach the capital. I wasn't even gonna go there right now, but I mean okay. Alter is fighting right now. Fighting her best. This is very important. You should never pull this trigger. If you do, your human cells will all fry out. So never pull it. It's actually supposed to be Chioko, but <laughs> I don't get many opportunities. And Ellie now has a big gun. Her superior may have her own reasons for fighting. But it does not matter to her. Pull the trigger. If the tank before her eyes reaches the capital, it will consume everything. All the human tanks, Megaman, Ruru, and her beloved commander. She wanted to prevent that at all costs. There's no time more appropriate to pull this trigger than now. Pull the trigger, Ellie. Ow, oh, that really hurt. Why do you gotta be like that? But what she feared most of all was her beloved superior seeing her changed. She knew what would happen to herself. A half-human battery tank, if she fired. She resolved to put an end to everything here. I won't let you get in al get- Oh my god. I won't let you get in- In Alter's way. Well, that's what happens whenever you put in words on sentences and expect me to read them right. It doesn't happen. But I don't even know who Alter is! <laughs> this is so much more fun, giving that thing some random lines. Some random BS lines. Oh, look, now I get to play as Ellie, and this battle is completely unfair, and I don't think that's... I don't know if it's even winnable. But I'm going to try something really special. I'm gonna do the lazy lean to the right strategy. This has always worked. Lazy lean to the right strategy. Yeah, why I don't know if this is a winnable fight is because Albatross fires differently than Albatross otherwise would. And there are also a bunch of scout tanks on the field that uh, rat out your position to Albatross. Which is really rude, quite frankly. This is the first time I've survived that opening a sack. Attack. <laughs> the lean lazily to the right strategy works! Oh, Albatross, you are screwed now. I'm a coming!
I just gotta keep leaning lazily to the right, away from the recon tanks. I might pull this off. Oh, damn it, Albatross is right in front of me. Never mind, I'm screwed. Also, I'm a battery tank, which means that there's no way in hell I would ever be able to hit it. Ah. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh, wait, Albatross, are you bigger right now? Than you otherwise would be? Albatross might be a six, uh... A six circle thing here. No, I was defeated by Albatross when I re in reality had like no chance of winning. Ooh. It can't be. She couldn't hear a thing. Did her eardrums explode? No, don't go. There was no sound. Nothing could be heard. Albatross was screaming, but Ellie could not hear its voice. Oh, so that's what happened. Albatross gazed ravenously at Ellie. She was a battery tank. Nothing more than a meal to Albatross. And she was lying helpless right before its eyes. I can't move anymore, she thought to herself. Since she used the railgun, the heat transferred through the railgun would have burned her human side. Surely she no longer resembled a human. The cells of her face would be broken down, her hair would be falling out, and her skin would be cracked. It would all have burned away. Sorry, Alter. I'm going to be eaten. You don't have anything to apologize for. Ruru. Cobalt rifle locked on target. Fire. Oh, that really hurt. You guys are just a bunch of dicks. Second shot. Firing. No. God damn it. She could hear again. Made it on time. No. She could hear her voice. Ellie? Don't look at me! Please, don't look. Sniff. You don't have to cry. But I'm all burned up. Don't look at me. Where? Lieutenant, Albatross has begun moving. Ellie, let's go. It doesn't bother you? What doesn't? How I'm all burned up. What are you talking about? Alter. Mega Man. We told you to go handle a situation. Why do you have to leave said situation to be handled by somebody else? Ah, you're never getting your ranks back at this rate. You just, you just disobey every order, don't you? Finally caught up. Mega Man, did you just leave Shibuya? I told you I can't handle it. And you wonder why your ranks are decreasing. Very rapidly. Great. What are we going to do now? It's because you said it's it's because you just suddenly ran off. Hey, I'm going to cry. I'm the one who wants to cry. There's nothing wrong with me? She could hear. Her own voice and the sound of snow. She could hear Ruru's voice, and Megaman's voice. She could also hear Alter's voice. <laughs> I don't know why I can't read so... so much. Why? She looked at her skin, hair, and body. Nothing had changed. What's the matter? What happened? I fired a railgun. I pulled the trigger. I pulled the trigger for Alter, but nothing happened to me. Railgun. Oh, Ellie's equipment. I'm. Hold on a second. I can't like make voice words. I'm having like a fit in my stomach apparently. All right. <laughs> like I couldn't force air out. It was weird. Oh, Ellie's equipment. What? Ellie's weapon? Are you talking about El? What are you talking about? Ellie is a tank that builds tanks. No. What? 
Ellie is equipped with a railgun in case of emergencies. Really? What? I mean, I knew she was a battery tank, but... What? Yes, she was originally equipped with one. She was later infused with human cells to repair her damaged body, and changed to a, to a tank developing tank. Then that means... It would be dangerous for her to use a railgun with her new body, so her equipment was made to be removable. I see. You're awfully familiar with her background, Mega Men. Oh, didn't I mention that I received an explanation from a Daihone Army officer, also known affectionately as Choco? You didn't. Well, continuing on. Coating was applied to her body, so that firing the railgun wouldn't damage her human cells. Wow. Mmm, this is going great. Appropriate measures to take. What? But Karara was against coding until the very end. Oh, why is that? Ellie is half-human tank, so she knew that using her railgun would be safe. She would go into battle to fight for you. Just like she did now. Ellie, you left to fight alone! Ellie, you look terrible. What's wrong? I didn't know. What? I thought my body would burn up if I pulled the trigger. Sadness. <laughs> D don't cry. Wait, I didn't tell you? So you thought that firing your railgun would be dangerous, but you fired anyway. Stupid Megaman. <laughs> Calm down, Ellie. Um, didn't I tell you? Don't make Ellie cry, Mix-Up Megaman! Stupid Mix-Up Megaman! Megaman, what are you doing? Kneeling in apology. Lieutenant, Vice Commander, this is no time to be fooling around! When did our moving reunion turn into a joke? Huh? What? Anyway, look at that! That where? Over there! Points. I can't see too well. Exactly! That's the problem! Oh, I get it now. <laughs> Took me playing through this once to get it. What can't you see? Is that Albatross? The thing that you can't see very well is Albatross, because it bit a hasty retreat while we were doing this. It was just like, See you guys! Bye! Have fun over there! I'm going to the capital now, but you mentioned there's a bunch of tasty meals over there. The capital is in that direction. I know. When did it get that far? We have to chase after it. Let's hurry. Alter. What? I was a human tank after all. Yes, you were. Alter's human tank. You bet. Yes. Score. It would not stop. It began to consume anything, even things that weren't human tanks, like that car in the background. Consumed. Human tanks, everything else, all were devoured. It began its attack on the final defense line that collapsed while facing an overwhelming army. The final moments of the capital defense line at Shibuya. There was only one force remaining to defend the main route leading to the castle of Japan. Royal Grand Cross the 10th Heavy Armored Tank Regiment. It's here! Missiles are ineffective against that tank. Assault tanks forward! So Albatross made it in time. Hey guys! I'm really hungry! Does anyone want to die? Major, urgent report from the shock squad sent in ahead of the rest of the forces. What is that? It's going to eat us! Ah, I don't know why I'm with the shock squad! It's taking in human tanks. Why, my voice just keeps changing. I don't get. Mm, those guys are delicious, but I'm still really hungry. Hey, I'm going to kill the rest of you, too. Is that okay? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Devour all you want, Albatross. Human tanks. Japan itself. Consume everything. Not going to happen. An ambush? Samurai tanks? At your command. Wipe them out. 
too slow. I said Samurai Tanks like a question. That wasn't what I meant to do, but oh well. Yeah. It hit. Sis's rifle is amazing. So it's you. Lieutenant Colonel Hongu, the tables have turned. Not really, but keep on keeping on, Alter. <laughs> Surely you jest. It seems you're unable to grasp the current situation. Just as Hongu said, it was clear to anyone's eyes that the Royal Army was outnumbered. But when the have numbers mattered before, never. Mm, guys, look, these tanks are really good. Can I have some more? The remaining Royal Army tanks were helpless against the Dreadnought-class Imperial human tank known as Albatross. Albatross is fully recharged. It won't stop until it reaches the capital. Too bad for you. It hasn't finished recharging. What? It's true, but don't let them desert, you know, don't let them lower your spirits. I'm still hungry and eating stuff over here. But keep having your little argument down there. I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. It's fine. That albatross just had a battle with our tank. It doesn't have enough energy. It won't be able to reach the capital at its capacity. That can't be. Bluff. Bluff. This was a bluff? God damn it, Mega Man. We won't let this chance go by us. We're taking it down, Lieutenant Colonel Hongu. What? <laughs> I suggest you retreat while you still can. Lieutenant is so full of confidence. She didn't hesitate to lie at all. She has the talent of a con- to Look, she can be a con artist. Nonsense. Crush them, Albatross. Do not let them get away. Okay, I guess I'll just start killing them then. I mean, I've already killed everything else because you guys are having this wonderful little moment to discuss what was going to happen. But now that everything else is dead, I'll kill them too. Oh, it's coming after us. What do you mean, oh? Are you stupid? Alter. I know. We'll defeat it. Yes. Ellie, are the tanks ready? Ready. Alter, you're the greatest con artist I know. Is that praise? Of course. Operation Kisarangi was finally coming to a close. They had nothing to fear, and expected nothing less than victory. Even if they... Uh, even if the capital's elite forces were all wiped out, they were confident they would not lose. Let's do this. Commence battle! Roger! We unlocked the new version of Ruru. The one with the cobalt rifle. Time to make some tanks. Here we go. What are we gonna build? Well, we gotta build a Tsubasa for uh, making a sniper later on. But we have to also build Beethoven, my new model tank. And we'll fill out the rest of the line with Muku. Just for you. And I'll also make a Leo, because the last Leo I had... Oh, whoopsies, I made one too many Mukus. Now I can't have the Leo. Is that gonna negatively, in fact, impact the strategy at all that I currently have? Maybe? I couldn't tell you, to be honest. Might. Actually, we shouldn't have any problems. What? Don't get out of here. We shouldn't have any problems. You know why? Because I've already played this battle. I know where the enemy command tank is. The albatross is right here. Which is odd, because I knew that to begin with. I've, uh, I guessed it correctly whenever the first time I was running this, so, yeah. Well, not really. Not really correctly. First, I guessed it was up in this area, but then Asagayo rained hell down upon me, and I was like, oh shit, well, Albatross can't be over there then. <laughs> so that's what Asagayos do. They rain hell down upon you. Oh yeah, there's an, Al there's, there's an Asagayo up there. Fun times, right? <laughs> I agree. It's so good. I love Vasagayos. They're so much fun to fight. It's not like they tear up my entire line every single time or anything like that now. Let's put some scouts around. I have a pretty good idea of what we're going up against, so we should be A-OK -okay to win this battle, but I'm not, you know, I'm not gonna just say, alright, that we're gonna win. 
I mean, we're, we're gonna win. I'm having a hard time thinking. Don't worry about it. No, that's a bad place for a Muku. Yeah, let's put it on, like, you know, the place that it can't do anything at. What a success! Alright, you can go on this side. It'll be fine. We have a lot of... We, have, we are allowed to put down a lot of tanks. It was, what, 17? Yeah. So we're gonna be putting, like, our entire army onto the field. And we're just gonna hope for the best. And it should be okay, because I'm... I'm pretty sure... They don't have anything deadly on their side. I mean, I have already run this twice now. I failed the first time, but you know what? I'm not failing this time. They have a, um... They have one of Sasagusa's tanks. They have, I think, two snipers. They have some lower tier tanks. They have a four-blocked assault tank, and then they have, a, they have the Asagayo. And the Asagayo is the real big threat, because that thing tears apart my entire army like a, just a giant jerk. Like a big old giant jerk. Now, the uh, the Albatross is a stupid weak tank that no one gives a crap about. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna throw a couple of as many tanks as I can need to be on this side because this is the side of the Albatross, and it's really hard to hit the damn thing. So the more damage I can stack on it, the better. All right, let's do it. I just need to save first in case this goes really really bad. But we should be perfectly fine. I already know the battlefield. I know for the most part what I'm fighting now. Did pretty good in my first two battles. Those were very, oh, they were very close battles, though. It was pretty cool. Albatross is going to reach the capital at this rate. Albatross is going to reach the capital at this rate. We have to stop it here. We can't defend against or evade Albatross's attacks. Be careful, Alter. It's no use. I'll show you the true fearsome might of Albatross. No, of human tanks. We're not going down that easily. Howl all you want. Go, Albatross. Send them out with a whimper. Okay! I mean, I have nothing better to do right now. Commencing battle. Move out! I have to make sure that you guys see what Albatross's attack is before we end here, because it's a really pathetic attack. It's like the world's just worst attack. Hi! It's like the world's worst attack. It's pathetic. You're right, okay. I might not do be doing this in the right order, but I think I'm okay. Oh crap, I forgot about this one being here, I'll be honest. There's a, uh... There's a Gonta, like, right over here somewhere. And it's gonna block my advance. Ah, oh, shh. Okay, well, where's the Gonto then? Nope, incorrect. Just move up. If the Gonto's here, it'll die. I'll murder it. Oh, wait. I mean, it can only hit me once. This isn't a guarantee, okay. though. I hate you. I might lose right away. Like, I might lose the Beethoven right away. Because, uh, they have the assault equivalent that they can make use of to destroy my Beethoven. It just depends on what I can do from here. There shouldn't be anything close to us just yet, but... Soon enough there will be. Oh hey, another one of you. Why I'm so happy to have seen you. At least you died fast. Clicky clicky. Alright. Ignore that. I should be able to destroy their grouping right here. Yep. And yep. Okay, cool. Good talk. They're all dead now. Even if I lose the Beethoven, I can always jog the uh, Mukus back over. And make use of them. Ah, who fired? I wasn't paying attention. It's a lower class barrage tank. Okay. It's not the Asagaya. When the Asagaya fires, everyone's going to die on the right side, so I really should be spreading out my right side force, but I haven't done that because I'm stupid. 
wonderful plan. Alright, let's start splitting up. We have too many tanks in such a small area, though. Alright, Gonta. I need you to die so that they don't know that we're over here anymore. Thank you. They should have eyes on my tanks over here. Yeah, Alright, so I'm going to deploy their special weapon. That was a close one. Another sniper. I've been hit! I've been winged! Alright, it's my turn. Alright, I'm going to destroy their assault tank over here, and I'm going to try to hit as much of Albatross as I can. Let's see how this goes. Do 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 do. There he goes. Where the hell is Albatross? Whoa, there are some guys over here. The battlefield was slightly changed. I mean, I I did it twice, and the battlefield was the same on both of those runs. Um. Albatross is over here! I mean, I'm not gonna complain. I'm not gonna complain, because Asagayo being over to the right was more beneficial for me on this one, because look, it's already been hit for three. Um, but normally, like the other two times I did this, Albatross was over there and doing nothing useful. Everybody else's positions had stayed the same. Everyone else is where I expected them to be. Like, you know, where they were the other two times. Only difference here is the Asagayo and Albatross swapped places, which is weird. I don't know if I'm going to be able to hit her. Let's do it. Yeah, take that. And one of those. It, it's fun, it's more fun with the barrage tanks because you can see like little like the missile flying in and hitting them. It's really cool. Um, that will force Albatross to attack us, which is going to be good. So it can show you know how it looks. I'm not even going to kill it, because uh, I don't want it to be dead this early. I want you guys to see what its attacks look like. So that whenever I complain about it in just a little bit, you'll be able to better understand why I would. There goes their L2 that was over here. Oh, are we spread out relatively well? It doesn't matter how the guy is going right now. Ow. That hurt, Asagayo. It's okay, the Cobalt Rifle doesn't guarantee a shot, like, doesn't guarantee a hit on the Albatross anyway, so that's fine. Alright, it's gone, so now we can start moving up. These are really weak units. How am I gonna get over to there? I could just ignore it safely. The thing, the reason I couldn't ignore it in the other ones was because it was in the cent, like, it was in the freaking center. It could hit anywhere it wanted. Um, this time it's not, so... Like, I can ignore it safely. Because they won't, it's not going to be able to hit over to the left. That's too far of a radius, but... I'm going to send some people slowly up. Go, my weak tanks. For glory. No, I can't hit it from here. They have eyes on me, really? Alright, that's it, Milk. Get in the fight. You've been authorized. Uh, look, I'm just trying to show them what the freaking Asagayo's attack looks like, because it's pathetic. Oh, you wanna you want you want you wanna do this? You wanna do it like this? That's fine, we're gonna do it like this. Alright, get good. Get good. No, get God. Get God! Become become a minor deity. It'll be good. So that's what has eyes on us. Alright. Can I hit that from here? No, not in the slightest. Alright. I could jog back and probably get it. Let's see. Nope, too short. The EO booking. Ah, oh, no, but I gotta keep going for the Asagayo. I only have a one shot with this thing? Oh god, why? Where'd that sniper be? Where would she be at? It's 
take a random shot. Ooh, I'm Albatross. I have to take evasive maneuvers. Ooh. You should have been dead in the beginning. You just got lucky to live this long. Hey, there's Albatross. Unfortunately, it's going to get a twofer here because uh, it's lucky. But that's its attack. That's its attack. Look at how pathetic its attack is. It's centered on it, and it's not even that good. This is the enemy that they've hyped up for this, like, three parts of this game. Three whole parts. They've been hyping up this. This. My goodness, it just destroyed us. Oh my god, it's such a powerful tank, except that it's not. It's a pathetic tank. It's stupidly weak. Oh, That's just being rude. I still have two milks, right? Yeah, I got two milks and I got this thing. It'll be fine. We just have to get to the jerk. Nope, we're not there yet. Uh-oh. Still not close enough? When I find you, I'm gonna shoot you once and you're gonna know. Okay, the sniper has to be around here. Like, it has to be close. You know, Albatross, you're being annoying this game. Is it because I've insulted you for three episodes, well, for three runs of this straight? Is that why you're actually being useful? But well, you're only being useful because I'm playing like a dummy. There you go, friend. There you go. There you go. Good night. Good night, good fight. Oh no, I'm dead! Albatross stopped moving. Enemy tank silent. That's impossible. We did it, Alter! Yay! Money for days. No, I don't want to die right now! The mesh of human tanks that made up Albatross's body began breaking down. February 28th, evening. The experimental Imperial tank Albatross sustained critical damage. The human tanks it assimilated fell apart one after another, letting out unheard cries. Did we beat it? Albatross, it can't be. Albatross was the very incarnation of what Hongu considered an ideal tank. A weapon without a mind of its own, fulfilling its only purpose. Destruction. Perfection. Don't die, Albatross. What? That's not really like something that I could just choose not to do. A weapon that would never betray was about to come to its end. It's still moving. This thing is just about as persistent as Siren. Ruru, prepare to fire. Roger. I'll do it. Ellie? Some of the tanks in Albatross are rebelling. No! Stop that! You're ruining the continuity of this character! You're all supposed to be dead inside! Perhaps it was just her imagination. Or perhaps she could hear the cries of her fellow tanks within the monstrosity in front of her eyes. Yeah, is this it? Is this it? What is that tank? I haven't seen it before. It appears to be an Imperial tank. Did it escape from the Royal Engineering Bureau? Then, is it the battery tank we've heard about? I'm sorry, everyone. Sorry I'm the only one who survived. It's reached its limits, though. Get back, it's going to explode! It can still be saved, man! <laughs> yeah! I'm sorry. I have a commander. I have to... Uh, 
I will help, says Albatross. Oh, help! What? What are you... A lie. I don't know what the hell a lie means. What are you doing, Albatross? I will help, Lieutenant Colonel! How? Are you... Protect, Lieutenant Colonel! How? Even if I go down today, I'll at least be able to have died for my commander! How? She was a human tank. She stood before her enemy to protect her superior. She became a shield, a wall for her. Is it defending Hangu? What? I thought it already lost its free will. Albatross. I will protect Lieutenant Colonel! <laughs> Dying for their superior fills them with happiness. Falling for their superior gives them joy. That is the instinct of human tanks. Your <laughs> Unbelievable. Ridiculous. You still want to die for me even after losing the ability to think. I wanted to believe in you until the end as well. If they can die for their superior, they will receive a pat on their head for their deeds. Because you know, that I'd rather die and get a pat on my head than live and keep helping my superior. That's the logic. How? Oh, just shoot already. Take me down if you can. How? Oh. I wasn't being serious. Please, no. Ellie. It's okay. I'm your human tank, Alter. I won't lose to it. Why do we, we can talk about this? Please, over a cup of tea. And, oh, God, no. Let's go together, Albatross. I won't lose. I can't lose. February 28th. The Capital Defense Army, led by the Acting Queen, defeated the Imperial Army's Dreadnought class tank. The Fuji ambush operation ended in the Imperial Army's defeat. The Imperial Army immediately retreated back into Fuji's forests after losing their main force and commander. Hangu could have left at any time, but she chose. She made the decision to develop her character ever so slightly more, and also die. She made that decision as well. A guerrilla war ensued in, Fu in Fuji's forests the following month. Oops, just knock stuff around. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm doing. The acting queen participated in this battle as well. So is Alter the queen now? Whatever. Along with the human tanks who deeply respected her. When she raises her arm forward, the tanks rush into battle without hesitation. They continue to fight. They were born for their beloved superior. Fight for their beloved superior. And die for their beloved superior. Akin to snow. And it will continue as so, ever on. Until they can be of use to their superiors on the battlefield, their battle will never end. Hmm. Are you dead? No. You moved! But I feel like I'm about to die. Wait, I recognize you! You're an Imperial tank! You're wearing a steel helmet! What are you doing here? Nothing. Aren't you cold? Yes. <laughs> Very! Wanna come to my house? No. I can't be a burden. You won't be! Oh, but you're an Imperial tank. This is the second half of the dream sequence! Yay! In case you weren't aware. It's okay. It'll be fine. I'll protect you. Protect me? Yup! <laughs> What's so funny? It's supposed to be the other way around. Human tanks are supposed to protect humans. That doesn't matter. Yes, it does. You have it mixed up. No, I don't. I'll protect you. <laughs> and fun for days. The start of something special. Then I'll protect you too. 
Ellie! Are you asleep? No. <laughs> the warm sunlight shining through the clouds melted away the snow at the edge of the forest. They stretch and brace themselves for the coming of spring. Mm, great weather to sleep in. I'm not sleeping. Alter, here's a list of supplies. Oh, it's Megaman. Oh, Vice Commander! Megaman, didn't you leave for Carrara's place yesterday? Do you have some business here still? Before I forget, congratulations on your promotion to Lieutenant Colonel. Looks like Carrara finally forgave you. Oh, Lieutenant Colonel! Still, I can't believe she dragged that on for two months just because you ate her cake. Um... Megaman, are you tearing up? Why are you tearing up? Lieutenant Colonel Yamana. Second Lieutenant. What? Karara sent me back again. Again? Mix up, Megaman. I couldn't help it. Specialty ramen was sitting on the table. If I left it alone, it would have turned soggy. What kind of situation is that? I see, then you still are... Then you are... Wait. Then are you still our Vice Commander? I'm in your care. No need to kneel. So where's Ellie? I have supplies to deliver. Over there. Oh, there she is. Ellie, I brought supplies. April 7th. The operation to wipe out all enemy forces within Fuji's forests ended. Bootback Megaman. Don't give me such a mean nickname. But it's funny. Ha 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 You suck. Booted back? Vuru, I'll show you. <laughs> it's been a while since the last Ishidaki. Alter. Yes? Where to next? The northern route seems to be facing trouble, so probably there next. I see. Their war was not ended. They will not stop fighting. Every fallen tank is another reason for her to fight. They continue to march through the barren plains, ready to face what awaits them. It is time. The call can be heard. Alter, it's time. Earlier than expected. Lieutenant! Can't be helped. Alright then. Human tanks! Charge! Oh boy! I obtained Aurora! You can now save clear game data. You can start a new game keeping your data. Yeah, I'll save my clear game data. There might be like different endings, who knows? I don't know.
Beethoven? Sure, why not? The Assault Tank line seems to be all about music. Well, after ditching Lassie and Muku, it went to Melody and then Beethoven, so... It's a weird-ass line, it really is. It's like, Cookie, Colin, Milk, because Milk goes with cookies, and then a Lassie, which is a dog. I guess, I don't think Colin is ever a dog, right? Lassie's the name of a dog, so, you know, but... I had Muku, I have nothing, I have no idea what that even means, so, yep. 70,000, god damn it. Why didn't I look at the price before I purchased things? Well, we're gonna go in with our normal squad then. Uh, put that over there, where it's nice and safe, hopefully. I only have one more Leo, because of that one battle where I lost all my Leos. Ooh, that's not good. Well, what can you do? Other than, uh, you know, keep on keeping on. I like how I'm just putting all my tanks right up against each other so that they can all be killed instantly. That's never been a bad plan. Not in the slightest. I totally think this is going to work out just fine. You know, I hit you once with a, re with a barrage. I only have to get lucky one more time. And I have a lot of shots to be putting into you. Okay, never mind. I'm down one shot. Um, but otherwise... I'm actually going to look for that stupid friggin' sniper at this point. There we go. Alright. Take pot shots at me now. It's a joke, because you can't, because you're dead. Haha, <laughs> it was funny, wasn't it? The punchline was you dying. Oh, good times. I'm not finding anything worthwhile to kill. Maybe from here! Your time is... Your, your days are numbered, Albatross. I'm almost there. They seem to have a upgraded Hikari. I wouldn't know offhand what that's called. But what that means is I need to fall back. Or not! Son of a bee! Well, at least we get to see the Game Over title card. Yeah!